coming a day of learning. Today is the 18th. Well, no, Maybe put it next because I, I need a place to put the book. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> I wouldn't mind sharing, but I need to put the book. All right, Rabosai. I think we're, the, we're on Kuf Bab with the, the Mishnah at the bottom. The last Mishnah on Kuf Bab. One, two, three, four, five, oh, yeah. six it's lines from the bottom. Kuf Bab on the, yeah, Kuf Bab. There's a bunch of Mishnahs on there. more Mishnahs on the page. Here at the bottom. All right. Is that <laughs> okay, Rabosa? This is don't you're not allowed to change the rules. Got it. Okay, it's right. So it's Kabo Sami Habera. A person took a field, he's gonna rent. Maybe remember the Mishnahis are either renters or sharecroppers. He's a renter. But he's paying in kind. Yeah, well, that's the point. In kind, if he ha if it it's in kind, if it's grown in kind. Well, uh, yeah, if it, you know, if the stuff he's paying is is grown, then it's in it's in kind. If, if, if it depends what he if he's not paying it. If he's if he's paying in produce and that's what he's growing, then he, he has to pay for the field. That's yeah, scenarios. right. No, no, even by a chok, even even, even, a, a, even, even by a chok, we learn. Even by a chok, even by a chok, if he grows what he's paying, he has to give from the field. We learn. We learned. We learned before. The zara sarim. Okay, lo yizan If the field was supposed to plant uh, barley. Okay, uh, 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 and he's gonna what? But he's gonna pay, uh, uh, in the case he's gonna pay wheat, he's gonna pay barley, he's gonna pay money. And I told you, if he grows what, if he pays what he grows, he has to pay from the field. But you're not allowed, if you if the deal was for barley, you're not allowed to, you're not allowed to plant wheat. And why is that? Because wheat depletes the grant the land more than barley does. So even though he's getting paid the, the, the right amount, you're not allowed to do it. Heat me sooner than but if he, but the, if the boss said that the deal was for wheat, he can grow, he can grow barley because he's paying a set amount anyway. He's paying a set amount, right? And okay, and 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 he's certainly not hurting the guy, okay? But Shimon Gamal also, Shimon Gamal says he can't do it. We'll see why later. Tabu Allah is going to keep this. So, same thing, if, if, if the deal was to grow grain, he shouldn't grow leggings. Why? Because they deplete the land more. Kid, this is going to but if the deal was to grow, uh, to grow legumes again, he's paying a set fee. Don't forget, he's going to he's allowed to, he's allowed to Actually, put grant. legumes. Uh, uh, are we going to see? Yeah, he says no. Oh, here they say no. And and what? He's going to what? You have to. You 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 are allowed to plant crop uh, grains. Shimon Gamliel also. Shimon Gamliel says no. I am of Christa. My time with Shimon Gamliel. What's the reason with Shimon Gamliel? If you're not hurting the guy, what's the, what is he? And you're paying a set rate. What does he care if you're changing the fee? Because it says like this: the past success. Chase Israel loyaso avlo. The Jewish people are not going to do. Are not going to do a perversion of justice. Well, they dabu kaza. They're not going to speak false. But they must be a Russian time. It's not going to be any language of of uh, of uh, of a uh, mis of uh, misbehavior of doing wrong. And therefore, what? So you see what they don't even speak wrong, even though they're not hurting, they shouldn't speak. Basically, the says, come on, that's not true. They, they can they can never change their words. They said one thing and they can never change. Basically, we learn Migwas Purim, the Purim. The money that the Gabayim collect to give a Sauda to the poor people for Purim has to be for Purim. And we don't care about how much it costs, even though what? Uh uh uh, we don't say, oh, look, we have enough for the meal. Let's give the rest of the tzedakah. No, you take all the money and you just give them. You give them a really lavish meal. And the poor person, who since they put the money for the for the poor meal, the poor person can't they take out that money and even take it out to buy a shoelace. I mean, unless he made a deal with the, with the with the government of the city of the of the of the elders of the, of the people who run the city, okay, to that he's allowed to. Dear Rabbi Yaakov, okay. Okay, Sha'omar Misham Rabbi Meir. That's Rabbi Yaakov, the name of Rabbi Meir. So you see that what? So you see, uh, okay, Mashim Gamliel, Rabbi Gamliel, make a Mashim Gamliel says, no, it's okay. And they're allowed to change it, even they don't have to go in front of the people of the city. And they're able to change it and buy, a, and buy something else. So therefore, what? Okay, so you see, even though what? Even, right, even though what? Here, over here, he's holding what? Even though they're going to change the language, they're, they're allowed to insist that just nobody's losing anything, okay, because nobody really cares. Okay, the fact that he, that he changed the language is okay. I'm going to buy it. He says, no. He says, you're making a mistake. He says, he says I'll tell you what, the, he, he, okay, the, the, it must be the reason 
of Rabbi Shimon is uh, is different. It can't be because if it's a tough question of what over here he says you can't always say you can't to change your language. So what is it? The time of Rabbi Shimon Kedemar, okay, it's like it's like who? Like Rabba like Rabba Bar Nachmani. Okay. Omar Mar. Well, because Rabbi Marachani said, I'm on the the Now there's two ways to read this. We're gonna read it, okay. Anybody who wants to 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 make their land unfallow, you understand, unfertile, okay. If you want to make it unfertile, you yeah, you want to ruin your land, please Rasha saw Khiti, Rasha saw Sa'ari. What you should do is one year plant wheat and one year plant barley. Okay. Just okay, saw see one one year you'll plow it. To the width, okay. We shall saw air one year plow to but more probably one year shall see your plow to plow to the length. We shall saw air one year you plow to the width. It's it's damaging. Amran elder, okay. So what's the point? So what's the problem? According to this reading, the problem is that he told you to put wheat because because he because he planted wheat last year. He doesn't want you to plant barley. Okay. Another way to read it is that uh, there's another way to read it that it's actually good. It, it, it's actually good. It comes out the other way. So then, but it's the same problem. But then the question of that, you know, what he planted last year, he's supposed to change. Okay. And, and you don't know what he did. It's, it's either way. Rotating. Yeah. Either way. Either way. Either way. You don't. He he knows what he planted last year, and he has a reason why you shouldn't plant it this year. Well, Amram, but we this whole din that we said that these changes destroy the land. Oh, low carbon That's only when after when when after you did the harvest. Okay, you didn't you didn't plow and replow. Oh, carbon tonic, but if you plow and replow once you did the harvest lesson of all, these changes make no difference. Okay, so we explained it. So we, basically the problem is we're afraid that the, whatever the interpretation you use based on what the guy planted this year, if you make a change, you may be hurting his field this year. Through Eloy's Reno kitness, we said we said if the if the guy told you to put, put to to plant um um uh, grain and you shouldn't plant legumes, etc. Master of Yehuda the Rabin, so Rabbi Yehuda taught this Mishnah to Rabin this way. To who he is the other, he taught him the opposite. And what if it, if if he told you to plant grain, you should plant, or you can plant legumes. Amr lace, he says, Bah non tan. So Rabin said, What are you talking about? Hey, how can you tell me that? He said, Didn't we learn through a Lajana's kidness? Did we learn that if, if it's grain, you should not plant legumes? Amr lace, he said to Lokasha. There's no problem. Okay, why? He said, he says, what? He says, when I said what I said, that you can run. That's for us in Bubble. Because Bubble, Bubble was an extremely <laughs> uh, fertile place. It was in the valley. We had lots of ponds, etc. Yeah, it's extremely, extremely fertile land. Okay? And therefore, what? He says, it doesn't make a difference. You can change and do what you want. It makes no difference. Okay? And there, in the Mishnah, that's, that's, that is in Eretz Israel, where Eretz Israel is, is, is mountainous. And there's always problems of the land, a very rocky land, very problems of land getting... Depleted, therefore you can't change. Okay, because it really destroys the land. I'm like with the the Rabin Rav Nachman. Rabin Achi says, Rabin, my brother, honey tichli de bekitna. This uh, a vegetable they call it. They call it um, uh, shichlaim. They call I forgot they call it. Uh, yeah, I don't even know what press is. That's what I know. That, I know that that's what. Yeah. It's a, it's a... Oh, it's like uh, a lettuce. It, it, well, it's like a weed, except you could you. It's very tasty. It's edible. Huh. Must be good. And yeah. I mean, I I put watercress in salad all the time. But the point is that it depletes. It, it grows naturally. It How come I go shopping? I never in my life saw watercress. You say, don't go to the produce. <laughs> Your wife says buy a bag of potatoes. That's right. You're a meat and potatoes guy. You're That's meat right. And broccoli. That's right. <laughs> Okay, she says this this crest. Event, okay, it, this it, it steals nutrients from the. Flax. Oh, that's the point. He says what he says. So this crest, when it grows in amongst the flax, If anybody takes it, but they're not stealing. Why is that? Exactly. Because 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 what? Because it damages the flax, and it's it, the damage it does the flax is worth more than the crest is worth as a vegetable. And therefore, if you steal it, you're doing the guy a favor. Omdos are ghoulin, but what? But if the rows, uh, 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 but if it's, if, if it's on the outer feet. row, if it's outside, right? If it, no, if it's, oh, if it, this first one, if it's outside of the of the flax, then it's stealing. Why? Because they're not damaging the flax. They already grew and they hardened and they're ready now, ready, they, they're ready for seed and they're no longer edible. I feel, I feel the big kitna, then even, even if they are, Amongst the flax, not me, Shmuel. So you're not allowed to steal them anymore. My, my time. What's the reason? My idea of it is because the damage, the damage you did already. You're not saving the anything. The, the damage already happened. I'm like we did the Rabbi Bar Nachman. Rabbi Nachman he said, "Honey, he said, Rabbi, my, my brother. He says, honey, dili dilach. He says, he says, you know what? He says there are some trees that are on my side of the border, but the fruits really go to you. Okay, 
But they lach the li, and there's some places where the, where the, where, the, where the fruits are on your uh, 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 that are really your fruit, and they belong to me. Okay, what? Another one. What's the point? Okay, because it means to say like this. It depends if the roots are go, if the roots go under somebody else's field. Then one way to read it is there's a lot of ways to read it. Well, then, then the then the fruits that are on the tree over the over where the roots are. Okay, the person's allowed to get. And that's the, and that, that's really the custom. That if a tree, if the, it means here, not that the bough, but the but where the roots lead to the other person's property over the border. Okay, lakan. Uh, okay, uh, uh, okay. That the root, the side of the tree, the roots are on nourish the above ground. Yeah, bro, the, 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 the fruits that are on that above. So he says once the right. roots go to this side. Okay. Okay, Lakan, and the fruits go to that. The fruits go to the guy where the roots are on his side. Lano to Lakan, and the roots that go to this side. Okay, and also the other guy's tree where the roots go to him, Lakan. Okay, so the, the so the so the fruits the fruits go to him. So either some people learn all the fruits, but other people learn just the fruits that are above the roots. The mark, because we learn Ilo no Let's say there's a tree that's standing. It doesn't mean on the border exactly. It means net on the some on a person's land that's next to the boundary between the two lands. Yeah, so, so it's really one person's land but next to the boundary. Amaraba, Noteb, Lakan, Lakan. Okay, so he says the fruits that are that are opposite the roots that are on this side, they go to the guy on that side, even though it's not his tree. But note the, okay, and and the same thing, the second guy's tree, Lakan, where the roots go to the other guy's side, Lakan, the fruits go to that guy. Shmuel Amar, Shmuel says no, he's talking. The first opinion, the Rav says what, wherever the roots are, you get the fruits. The, the, Shmuel says he's split. So now, Mesive, and second, let me ask you, Kasha, we learned in a Braisa, Elan, Omen, Elan, Eitzar, up now you had a Marav talking. We learned the tree that's standing, like we said, next to the border. Okay, and the roots are going into into into, into, exactly, into another exactly. field. Uh, no, no, no. It, it really means like I'm telling you. It really means it's in somebody's property, but it's next to the border. So therefore, what? Okay, and and the and the roots go there. Yeah, haloku. They have to they have to split them. Two the rabbis. It's kasher rab. How come rab said what that the fruits the whatever's the over the roots whatever's over the roots you get. Uh, it says you split it. The answer is what? Now, this, and this is what I pointed out. I love these these pieces. These are some of the first things I ever teach. Who answered in the name of Rav? We asked the Kasha Rav, who's answering? His opponent. Is it, look who's answering. Look who's defending him. His opponent is defending him. And why is it? Because that's how we learn Gemara. Everybody's, everybody's arguing for the sake of truth. Nobody's arguing to, to defend their point. He, he, even if even if, even if, even if Shmuel was against Rav, but he says, listen, you want to knock out Rav? Let, I'll do the knocking out over here. Don't 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 pose don't pose the weak arguments against my opponent, please. You know he fights for the truth no matter what. So Tigger Shmuel, he with the Rob. So Shmuel says what? Shmuel answered according to Rob. No, don't worry. The Mamali, okay, you can say what that that okay, call them eights are cooler. It's where the roots are going to both sides equally, and therefore what? So therefore everybody's getting the fruits that are exactly above the roots. That's exactly what. There's no problem. You know, see, that, 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 that's why they get it. Yachi Mila Mam was supposed to one second. That's so obvious. Why would the Bryce ever say it if that's the case? No, it's not so obvious. Why? Okay, the tali tune lechad gisa because what? Because be, be, because the roots, the the, the the trees on one piece of land, and the roots are going both sides. But the but the fruits, okay, on the on the on the on the on the on the bough are tending to go are tending to go the other are tending to go the other way. Okay, and, and they're going to another field, and therefore what? So so um, are going the other way. I be So wait a minute, that's obvious. Okay. So then, therefore, what? So therefore, since okay, uh, uh, since the split, since the splitting has to do with the roots, okay, and not where it is, uh, and not where it, it's obvious. Still, you follow the roots and not where they, not where it is on the branches. The like Gemara says, no, you think where the branches are. Why? Because you might have thought Yomale plug hachi, okay. Because here's why. Uh, think of it this way. Um, we have to split, right? Now, what happens, it, depending on where the borderline is, if you split in one direction, all the fruits are going to be what? All, 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 the, the, the split, the, the, uh, uh, tree means the, the, the tree, yeah. The, uh, um, uh, 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 it's going to come out that what? So then it's going to come out that one guy is going to get all the fruits because everything's in his side. Okay, so they come out. my why should you just split it that way? You have to split it the other way. That comes out that both of them actually gets half half of the fruit. Yeah, exactly. You know, you don't split it, split it, split it away. All the fruit goes on one side. I mean, okay, this is all a problem. I didn't explain everything properly because I told you whether you read that what that one that the guy where the roots go gets everything or 
or uh, we never meant other than always you always get what somebody needs. Not everything. Everything that's above this side of the uh, wall, uh, which uh, is the row. Yeah, there's even an opinion the other way. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna let Rabbi Huda. I'm, I'm gonna let it go. I'm gonna, for for my sake. I'm gonna let Rabbi Huda. Rabbi Ben Nachman. Rabbi Nachi said, "Lo tizban ara dismicha lamata." He says, "What?" He says, "You shouldn't buy land that's close to the city." Why? Dam Ravo or Dam Ravuna? I'm a rabbi. He says, "I'll tell you why." Also, all them shemal asadecha beiro b'shashem liyakamasai. You know, we have a rule that you're not allowed to sit and look at a person's field. You know, when it's in it, when it when it's a stand, with its standing growth. Why? Because you don't want to give an ayin so, because people can give an IR, so it's better. Don't don't put, put don't put your fields in. People can there. look at it. Nobody nobody nobody, 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 nobody give an IR. When I says, "Any is it really true that that does Rob really hold? You shouldn't buy land next to the city." I'm going to show you. Rob holds Dafka. Good thing to have land next to the city. I've asked you, Rob Abba, let me do the Rob. Rob Rob Abba found the Talmud of Rob. Amalu, and he said to him, "My Rob Hanikroi, how does Rob explain these psukim?" Well, but in the bracha it says bracha to be here, blessed are you in the city. Bracha to Masada, blessed you in the field. Bracha to Bovecha, blessed are you in your coming. Bracha to Tzayasecha, blessed are you in your going. Bamule, and they answered him. Here's what Rav said. Hachem Rav. This is how Rav interpreted the psukim. Okay, okay. Hachem Rav. Bracha to be here. What do you mean you're blessed in the city? She beischa samel chabeis akenesis. Your house should be close. Your house should be close to the shul. What is it being blessed to you in the field? She and the chasel grow in the year. What that your property, your field should be near the city, so it won't be hard to, to gather in everything. So you see what he held the opposite. He held what that it's a bracha to have your field near the city. Okay, let's continue. Bracha to bavecha, blessed are you coming. Shalom kimatzi ishtu chasavik nida. Blessed are you when you come. That your wife shouldn't be perhaps nida and forbidden. So you, now some people are. What do you mean? What should say? Why don't you say what? No, she shouldn't be nida. The answer is they say that it's worse. Some people learn that it's worse when she's a suffolk nida than when she's vada nida. Why? She, when she's vada nida, you know, no, she's no, forbidden. You forget about it. But when she's a suffolk nida, you can be figuring, trying to fig, you're yeah. going to try and figure out all kinds of ways. Maybe it's okay. And so you don't want to have that problem. Some people learn it's partial. It just means doubtful and certainly not for sure. The other way is what doubtful is worse than for sure. Bishas be also in a derech, okay, what, uh, okay uh, so it shouldn't come out. She's a suffolk nida. Bishas be also in a derech. She shouldn't come home when you come back, back from a trip and she's a suffolk nida. What do you mean you're blessed when you're going out? She say say should be the ones that come out of your of your inner should be like you. Your children should be like you. Be like you. Yeah. The Amarlu, okay, and he so he said to them, okay, Rabbi Yochan Lamarch, he said, Rabbi Yochan didn't say that way, Rabbi Yochan learned the Psukim differently. You should have a bathroom there near the table, you should be able to go. I will base a Knesset, okay, uh, 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 but what? No, but he he, he never held big Knesset is a problem, okay, uh, okay, uh, yeah, okay. I Rabbi Yochan the time, why is that? Why did Rabbi Yochan not want the big Knesset to be close? No, I'm right, because he said, you get you get you get for walking. That's but, why you put in. Uh, that's correct, absolutely. What does it mean you're, you're blessed in the field? It means that you should, it means that you're that you're present, you, you should have divide into three. Shalish but to a third should be what? Should be in your field should be grain. Shalish but zayim, right? A third in olives. Shalish but gafanim, and a third in vines and grape vines. Now, so baruch ata bavayecha, baruch ata b'tzei secha. What does it mean? You should be blessed in your coming, blessed in your going. Should tei tziyascha mina olam. We also have when a person leaves this world. When you leave this world, it should be like when you came. Ma biyasu ba olam belokhe. Just like came into this world without sin. Afi tziyascha mina olam belokhe. Also the going on. Okay, but you should be without sin. But but the main point is what we saw clearly that what that that Rav learned clearly the other way. You, how can you tell me Rav says what you should never feel near the city? Rav said that's the bracha that you feel should be near the city, should be able to be able to take care of it. Well, Kasha, don't worry. He says Rav, really Rav said two different things, but they can explain. Oh, when Rav said what uh, that it's good for the for his, for his field to be near the city, the Mahadev uh, uh, the risk of the, yeah, it's it, it, the, 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 it's where your field is hidden. There's a, there's a wall around it. Or 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 a picket fence, you know, saying a fence of branches around it. So therefore, what nobody's going to see it. Oh, when he said what? Okay, he, 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 when he said don't have a field near the city. So when there's not a wall or a or a branch fence around it. And so these so obviously the answer is what it's good to, if you if you protect yourself from Ayn Hara, it's good to have your your field next to the city. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 Now the pasuk Hashem is going to keep kol choli away from you. So what does it mean? What is kol choli? So kol choli means what? He says we're going to learn what the thing that the thing that 
brings all sicknesses. Amar Rav, he says, what is, what is, what, what is Koch Oren? He, he learns not, not all illness, but the thing that brings all illness. So what, uh, zu Ayin, he says, that's the, that's the evil eye. Ayin Hara is what brings all these. Rav the time, and Rav follows his reasoning. The Rav Solik will be Kivrei. Rav went to the went up to the to the to the graveyard. Avad, what they uh, uh, yeah, and they used to make him hide. They shouldn't be destroyed. Avad my Avad, and he did whatever he did. He knows he had a way to find out how people die. Okay, well, Amar Tishim Batisha by and Ra, ninety nine out of hundred died from from Ainara. Okay, and someone died naturally. Ninety nine out of hundred people died from Ainara. He says. Shmuel Amar Shmuel says Zeharuach. He says he says what what is called holy. What is the thing that causes all the sickness? He says, really, that's wind. Wind causes all the sickness. He says, Shmuel, the time, Shmuel, according to Israel, he says, Shmuel, Shmuel said, Akol Baruch, every, all illnesses come from uh, yeah. from wind. From wind, from wind, okay? And, and why is that? Because for everybody, there's some, uh, 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 there's, everybody has a certain wind that's good for, you know, that that's fitting for them, okay? But the, with the wind blowing uh, is what brings all the illnesses. So Shmuel, okay, I, I, what are you talking about? How can Shmuel say everybody dies from the wind? You see, people are killed by the government. They're not killed by the wind. It says, you see, even the people who are killed by the government, they love Zika, if it weren't for the winds that, that, that hurt them, okay, they would be able to heal, even those, those cut limbs, they'd be able to, uh, to heal them and, and mend them. But Hanina Amar, Zutino, Hanina says, what, what is all illness? What brings all illness? He says, it's cold, it's, it's cold, cold wind. The Amar of Hanina, he says, a cold, this is famous, he says, "What well, all the things that happen to a person that, that is from the hands of heaven? Okay, the, a person can't can't stop it. Okay, except for what? But 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 and the, the, we're going to translate here, even though we tra Rashi translate different other places here. But from from cold wind that that that, that blows on the on the man. Okay, Shemar said, What that these cold winds that are blowing? Okay, and the cold the, the cold winds and and the, the and the and the and the cold. Okay." Uh, uh, that uh, that are on that blow on the way of the stubborn one and the stubborn one. Okay, why is he called stubborn? Why? Because he can get out of it. If you care about your own health, you stay away from them. So therefore, what? It's up to you. If you should you should watch out. Keep out of the keep out of the cold. Okay, Dama Rabbi says that's talking about the refuse. Okay, we'll see like mucus. Dama Mar the the mucus of the nose, but and the mucus of the ear. Ruben Kashem Yikim Yafet. A, a lot of it is bad, and a little bit is good for a person. Allah's Omer, okay, Zumar, he says, you know what, you know what, you know what all illnesses are? He says, that's really talking about the, the, the bitter, uh, bitterness of the gallbladder. It gets into a person, and it makes a person, it makes a person sick. Tanya Nami Hachi, we learn that way. Machala, when it says, when the Pasuk says, uh, I, the Pasuk says, Hasirosi, Machala Mikebecha. So it's a, uh, 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 so Machala is a sound of like what? It, it makes ill. No, it's instead of machla being an illness, it, right, it gives the illness. It's, a, it's a, act, a transitive verb. It gives the illness. Okay, machla zu. Okay, uh, zumbar. Okay, that's what what causes the illness. It's the gallbladder. But lama nikrishma machala. Why is it called machala? Because because it makes ill the whole body of a person. Another way to learn. Okay. Yeah, machala to gematrius. Okay, if you take the take the gematria of machala. So the lamet is thirty. The mem is forty. Is seventy plus ches is eight. Seventy eight and five is eighty three. Eighty three. Shmona b'shlosh chalaim. There are eighty three illnesses to lulim b'mara that are dependent on the gallbladder. Huh? Then not me. I'm glad, they, I'm glad they got the mess. So that now you only have 82 to go. I'm, 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 yeah, I, I, I'm glad they got the mess. Yes. Yeah. So I told you, remember, I'll tell you something in a minute. Bemar, Bechulan, okay, Pashachris, Bemelach, Vikita Shamayim, all these things, all these illnesses. The person eats bread and salt in the, in the morning, Vikita Shamayim, and a pitcher of water, okay? And about Lasan, it will cancel them. And Rashi says, water, if you don't have wine, better wine, yeah? Yeah, that's that's it. That's the that, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, this is talking about this is a different one. This is this one. This is the pasuk. This is Rashi. Rosi machlo mikirbecha. Different pasuk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, so, yeah. Okay. Tanur Abanan shlosha sadvarim nemer b'pashachos. There are thirteen things that 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 are beneficial from eating breakfast. Okay. Okay. Uh, why is that? You know, bread. You know. Matzel, it saves a person from heat, from the cold, from 
from uh, from illnesses that come from wind. I mean, as mazikim from demons, or machkim as pesi, it makes it makes it makes a foolish person wise. Okay, okay. Well, because he's uh, because he's not in, he's not uh, he's he, yeah 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 he's not starving. The person is also going to win his court case because he'll be able to explain himself properly. He'll be able to learn Torah and to teach Torah, okay? Because again, he's, he's settled. Okay, and people are going to are, are going to hear what he has to say, okay? Because because he's able to express himself properly. But Talmud is other, and his learning stays in his hand. He remains. He remembers his learning. And his and his uh, his skin doesn't bring up sweat and uh, and heat. This this and also what? And if he's a person. That that has that has has desire. He's going to he's going to he's going to be yeah. What? But it, it, oh, he's going to be strong enough. And he's what he's going to live with his wife. And he's not going to have a desire for other women for for different women. He's going to do the right thing. Well, but, that's from the French tops. Yeah, Yeah, <laughs> and it kills and it kills parasites in the in the intestines, worms. And some people say what. Af motzi as a kina, and also what also takes jealousy out of a man's heart, or machli sa saava, and and it, and it puts love into his heart for other people. Okay, okay. Uh, why? Because uh, uh, because when uh, when a person, yeah, he's not jealous. He, yeah, else it's a, he, and, he, and, and he's not, and he's not, and he's not likely to be angry. Also, yeah. What's that? The cookies, That's the, the cookies. cookies. Yeah, the cookies. You don't want to be. You know, when people have low blood sugar, they get angry. So simply, when people have low blood sugar, they're not nervous. They get angry. Amalei Rabba the Rabba by Mari, they're intolerant. I'm Rabba the Rabba. He says, "Mano minai milsa damrinchi." Where does this come from? What people say? Uh, they say shiti miti road. Run. Uh, let sixty people run. Six people will run after a guy. Below matu the gabra the mitzafa car. They won't catch a guy who ate bread for breakfast. Who ate his bread in the morning? Rabba and the rabbis say, "Okay, uh, okay." And the rabbis say also, "Okay." And it was the, it was Rabbi Kiva. What he said to his sons. Get up and eat in the morning. In the summer, for because of the, because of the heat shouldn't damage you. For the winter, it's in that the cold shouldn't damage you. Okay, Amalei says. So where's the pasuk? He says because it's written in in the nevuah of 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 Yeshaya. And it's talking about the ingathering of the of the all the exile. Now you're able to eat smell, They're not going to be hungry. Not going to be thirsty. And they're not going to be smitten by the heat by the by the shar uh, and shemesh. Okay. Uh, what, what does that mean? It says Okay, the 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 uh, and the and the and the sun are not going to smite them. Why came into Because they're not going to be hungry and they're not going to be thirsty. Okay, so they're going to be they're going to be they're going to be protected. Amar le said to him, Atamar the mihasim says, use that pasuk. But I He says, I'll bring you a different pasuk that also proves it from the Torah. You'll serve the Lord your God, a rare slach mecha, and I'll bless your bread, bless me mecha, your water. You'll serve the Lord your God. So you create shmatzvila, let's create shmatzvila. Rebecha slach mecha, bless me mecha, and he's going to bless your bread and your water. Okay, zu pas melech hakita shamayim mi kan ve'elech. Note when he did these things, he'll bless the bread and the water. Mi kan ve'elech, and what follows after that? We so ate the bread, we ate the pas shachris. He says, Vasi rosi, a machal mi kirbecha. After this, says, What? I'm going to remove. The illness from your midst. I'm going to be who the Rav Ada Mishocha. He says he, he says Rav Ada was a person who was called he measured man. He was a surveyor. So he said to him, "Lo tezalza be meshichato." He says he says okay. He says don't 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 take your job of surveying lightly. Why? Because of, but not making when you're surveying who owns what land. To call Porto Porto, even the little tedious piece of land that you gave give to you know maybe give to the wrong person. Chaz of the Korkam It's good. It's a place where a person could. Could grow karkum uh, uh, saffron, could grow, very, yeah, very garden very saffron. Very it's expensive. Very That's right. So no, even a little bit, even a little bit that you might mis misappropriate or mis or misassign is a great loss. A person, even a little teeniest bit of land, a person can grow something. I'm going to read the Ravada He said, he said, he said, he said to Ravada, the surveyor, Abba Amos the the Negro. Now, here's the point. You have waterways or rivers. You don't want planting right up to the banks because it destroys. The, the waterway or the river and it, it, it takes away the water. So he says, he says, when you're when you're measuring, so and the custom was not to plant within four amas of these waterways. So they shouldn't be, so it shouldn't get so of the so so you, the, when you measure the four to the water canal that brings the water from the you know from the river to the fields, Zalzabuhu. He says that you don't have to be you don't have to be so exact. You don't have to be so exact. Okay. 
But when you measure the four to the river, he says, don't measure at all. Okay, but what you just just estimate it and make it a very absolutely clear that it's quite wide. Okay, and why is that? No, it's why do you have to be less exact by the, by the small waterway and more exact by the river? And 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 so why do you have to be? Don't worry about so much, but by the river, make sure that it's really wide. Okay, Rabbi Yehuda, the Kame. Uh, no, I'm Rabbi Yehuda. Arba Amos da Nigra Lebene Nigra. The whole point is like this: Who is we making the whole rule of leaving four Amos unplanted? Is for the guys who have the canal, okay? And they are they are private guys, okay? It belongs to them, okay? And they 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 can mohol, so they okay. They, they said so they don't have to be. It's not so bad. They can let go down a hara, but the four Amos on the riverbank, the Kuliyama, that belongs to everybody. And there's nobody's going to have a right to what to give to, to Mochel, to forego it. And if you have to be very, very much be not to do less. Machri's, okay, Rabbi, I'm a Malokit be Nagli betray every Nahara Kutsu. And there's a forest on two sides of the river, okay, you have to, you have to, you have to cut, you cut down the forest up to the shoulder width of the uh, shoulder That's width right. of the people who pull, right? They, remember, they were pulled, right? They would pull the boats, they would go onto the banks and pull. Okay, so you have to so you have to have you, so you have to give him uh, uh, you have to give him all the way to the end of their shoulders so they can get on the back and pull and you cut down people's forests. Of Nachman Bar Hoshia cuts okay Shita so he used to cut he, he used to cut uh, sixteen amos what like Hoshia Rabin okay so the people the people from the city came uh, uh, and what and and they owned. Uh, uh, the Fanu, okay, they own, they own, okay, they own the, uh, 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 the wooded area. Yeah, they, they are there, and they, and they, and they, and they divided it, okay, 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 no, it's, uh, but no, okay, uh, 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 okay, uh, so why did he make it so wide? So who saw bar, okay, uh, he, he says he he thought what he like said what Bishkur Shisrabi has to be just like any public domain. You have to have a, like a public domain below you, but it's not true. Awesome, Okay, over there, Ubayush is Robin. You need sixty namas. Why? Because uh, okay, uh, because you have to have the people the passing and the wagons, whatever it is. Okay, uh, 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 because you need a big area. But when it's come to the riverbank, you don't need such a right area. It's only one. It's for the people to be able to pull the rope to, that pulls the boat. The Kamalo Ktepi Nagdi Sagi. As long as you have the shoulder width, okay, uh, 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 of the people who who pull it, it's enough. Rabbi Avuna Habi Leahu Abba. He had a certain uh, he had a certain forest Aguda Darhar on the riverbank. Amrle. So the people who who had had what to do with it, they said that Nekutz. They said Nekutz Mari says he says you cut down the trees, make way, make way for the guys to pull the boat. So Marley said, listen, Kutsu Leahu Tatoi Mahadi He said, listen, you know what? Let the let the one above me. And below me cut, then I'll cut. If they the cut, cut, if they cut. Now you have to know why, because the people above him and below him. Okay, how can he do that? The rule is you have to cut. How do you do it? The answer is well, obviously was written. It's kosher with kosher. What do you mean? What are you waiting for other people to do it? The word is kosher with kosher means what? You know, it simply means take the you know take the take the uh, take the straw, but it's not from from between your eyes first. Uh, take the straw from your eye first, and then take it from other people. I'm very lucky. Like I said, what? De de decorate you, what, what, adorn yourself. And, other, and then adorn others. So you don't tell the people to do first. You should be doing first. Why are you saying let the people above me and below me do it? The law, the law is you got to cut it. Why don't you cut it first? He says, no, I tell you. He says, Hasam Abu Dhabi Pazi Rufila Habi. He says, you make a mistake over there. The the the, the forest above him and below him on the, on the, uh, 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 along the river, right? That belong okay. That belonged to the to the Persian uh, governor who was called Parzak, Parzak the governor, okay. But Amar, okay, and therefore he said, "E kaitu, I kaitu." If he's going to cut his armor, cut mine. Below kaitu, but if the governor is not going to follow the rule and cut it, on my equus, why should I cut it? They're not going to. They're not going. They're going to have to go on the other side of the river. They're not going to work on the side of the other side of the river. And then Dafka for those for that area by me, they're going to come over and come on my side. They're not going to come on my side at all. Di mentalu yeshlayu, okay, mistagel, okay, because because only what. Only uh, if only if all of the all if uh, uh, they have to they okay it, 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 if they can able to pull the ropes that's enough only if, so if all the sides of what of the river are cut they'll then they'll come on the side if not they're not going to come so it wasn't he was lazy he just said be low but if what but if not everybody they cuts it down no yeah they're not going to they're not going to be able to walk they'll be if they, if they're cut they'll walk here and pull the ropes but if not okay they're not going to be able, they're not going to be able to walk over here. And that yeah. we will call it a duh. I really don't think very much. So, yeah. Barging around. Barging around.
Yeah, birthday. Hey. Uh, Happy birthday. It's high season for Shabbos and Yantif. Yeah. High season for Shabbos and Yantif. You got a few hours of Shabbos and High season for Shabbos and Yantif. Yeah. It's, it's Yantif. Yeah. I, I couldn't. It, I, we, got, we, we, we thought it was Friday. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, we, 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 we couldn't. Get, I mean, my wife says, the didn't make sure. I thought today was <laughs> Sunday. That's, I thought today was Sunday. Every day is Sunday. We had a couple of people there. They were there. Well, there were there were there were there were there were there were No, 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 no. There were a lot of there was Bob and a lady. We had a bunch of people. Yeah, we had a bunch of people. Twenty. Tuesday, Wednesday, we had two, and but yesterday we had also a decent crowd. Oh, the rain for the Bob Duffy. Six thirty. Six thirty, then from. Six thirty. That's a short. That rabbi spoke nicely. Yeah. And you know, I heard good things about people are saying that you can become the rabbi. <laughs> <laughs> well, you left. Uh. Well, Everybody guy. deserves a little fun. <laughs> you know, if you get finished in this world, you're free in the next. When I, when I went to this world, yeah. oh, no, 17. Okay. So, oh. 17. Oh. 17. So yeah. the, then it was very common, you know, for rabbis, mm -hmm. rabbis to retire. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> 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 <